Yeah, so we're right in front of DPD headquarters. Yes, when tear gas was, was deployed, yes, I was in, in the midst of the tear gas. Uh, but that, yeah, that was I, I heard you say some sensible stuff that this went from peaceful to, uh, to a little violent here. Uh, what went wrong all of a sudden? I'm not certain, but I do know that my officers had the direction to make sure that this was a peaceful protest to provide uh, traffic control. We had all the streets blocked off. They had the entire run of the street, sidewalks, um, and everything was peaceful. Then all of a sudden, we start hailing, hitting our squad cars, hitting the officers. We had an officer whose uh, uh, DFR is treated, and then I almost got hit with a brief. And Dr. Grayson and I were standing trying to make sure that it was peaceful, and then here comes the brief. So once, so once the officers are under attack with bricks and bottles of water, of course, they're, here comes the disruption. And so we, we are an organization constantly uh, upholds peaceful protests, but we will not be the targets. We will not be the targets. I saw you talking to the leader of the protest saying, hey, they started out peaceful. Uh, you think it's just some, some tag-alongs? Because it wasn't like this earlier. I have no idea who they are. All I know is there was probably 600 people out here. And when you start throwing bricks, we have no idea who's who and where the bricks are coming from. All we know is that officers are getting, getting hit, our squad cars are getting hit, our tires are being flattened on our cars. Now we're under attack. Now, now that changes the whole dynamics of the game. So how dangerous is it for both ends? How dangerous for the, for the citizens and for the police officers? It, it's dangerous for both, and it's unnecessary. We're working so hard. Dr. Grayson, who's out here, Chango, who's out here, we've all worked together in order to build partnerships in this community, and it tears them down from both sides. And so we have to do that. We have to come together, sit down, and peacefully discuss. We are all empathetic. Our hearts go out to, to, to George Floyd's family. And we all have stood up, chiefs across this country, myself, uh, about what has happened. But the answer is not to then attack Dallas Police Department. That is not the answer. How are you going to get everybody in safely tonight? What's the, what's the move now? Our, our goal is to make sure that, that as long as they're, they're peaceful, they can stay out here. We're going to make sure that they're safe. That's our goal. Thank you, Chief. Thank you. Uh, Jay, thank you very much.